<laughs> What's up, guys? This is Shake and Bake. I think I've totally lost my mind for a couple reasons. I'm playing a game right now called The Tree of Life, as you see right here in front of you. It is the stupidest game that I've ever played that I can't stop playing. This game <laughs> uh, is the most addicting thing. And I think, to be honest, what it is, is the music. The music. I now hear this music in my sleep. And the other thing is, you may have noticed I got a little less uh, hair. Um, it's getting hot where I live. And um, two things. It's getting hot. And the other is, I noticed I was starting to do uh, the dreaded comb over. And there is nothing worse than the comb over. So I manned up and just took it off. Uh, that's just the way it is. And some of you, as you get older, genetics will kick in and you will end up like old shake and bake. Now, let me take these things off here before I uh, have a migraine. Okay, so tree of life. Da, da, ba, ba, ba. <laughs> this music. It never stops. And, you know, I could turn it down. I can't. I love it. <laughs> All right. So what is this? I needed a new game. I needed something I could just sink my teeth into. And sometimes you got to take risks, right? This is an early access game. And so I did it. And here it is. So what this is, MMO, you're on this huge island, right? And I'm sure there's a bunch of people. I don't. Have, I don't have. I don't think you can figure out what the count is. Who who's on here? PVE, PVP. Uh, you're gathering resources. You're crafting. I've started the Baker Village right here. You could create a clan guild, whatever you want to call it, um, and build these huge fortresses. And uh, there is a kind of uh, I, I want to say morale system, more of a. You know, if you start whacking people, you're, they'll turn red and they'll know you're kind of a, not a nice person. Now, what do I like about this game? Well, I love the craft and just to sit here and kind of build stuff and farm is really kind of fun. Uh, actually, let me go back because I want to make a fishing pole and go fishing again, which was a lot of fun. But exploring this island is really cool. There's like a different um, geographic uh, regions like desert and mountains and snow and all kinds of cool things quirky looking game i mean graphics wise it's i mean nothing uh it doesn't look bad but it's got kind of a cartoony thing going on it's just fun to play it's kind of relaxing and quirky and fun and so i'm digging it uh but let me let's uh hold on a second let's uh i want to make a fishing pole let me go back here right there uh i see fishing pole i need braided straps and some twigs i got plenty of that all right where's my braided straps all right and how this works is basically to level up your skills you have all these different kinds of skills farming fighting uh crafting and you have to kind of craft basic things do basic things to level up to and it's kind of cool all right let's get our fishing pole we're gonna take that with us Oh, night is coming. I do have a torch. You hear that music? The, little, the tune has changed. We'll pull up my map. There's a lake right down here, but there's a cliff right there. So I'm going to head... I, I, I almost feel like I'm uh, in a monastery. Ooh. <laughs> it has that sound to it. I mean, when I'm done, I'm so relaxed. I have like the greatest sleep. It's just a, something different. Besides blowing people up, shooting, banging, and whatever else, I needed a change of pace. And this is, uh, so far, I'm digging it. All right, let's go this way here. All right. I'm pulling my map there. Oh, here we go. I'm going to do a little fishing here. I don't, I don't like the fact that it's nighttime fishing. Uh, the day and night cycle is pretty fast in this game. Um, I don't know if some they're going to slow that down a little bit, but it, uh, it cycles pretty fast. And at nighttime, these... Let me get my dagger out, actually. At nighttime, these um, creatures come out, these skeletons and, you know, different kind of uh, ele PVE kind of uh, elements that you got to deal with. Oh, dude, come on. Kind of riding that mountain down. And in my journeys to fish, you're going to see some of these other places out here. 
Now, last time I fished there, there's a cliff, and I fell, and I don't want to do that. All right, here we go. Listen to that. There's a, here's a skeleton dude right over here. It's hard to see. It's, I know it's dark, but here's someone's place over here. You can go over. Damn it. And like chit chat with them. But I'm going to run away from the bones guy here because uh, I mean, I, I think I probably could defeat him, but it, you can get your butt kicked. And, and, and the more you use your dagger and your tools, the better you get at them. But uh, for this video, this opener, I'm just going to keep going here for a minute. I want to gather some more of uh, this soul piece is needed when you die. You turn into a ghost. Um, and then you need those to, it helps you spawn quicker. All right, we're almost down here to the river. I'm going to gather me some uh, fishies. Looks like somebody's over here running by. They got a yellow name tag. I'm not too worried. If it was red, then I'd be worried. Now, kill on sight. I was killed once. But to be honest, it's been pretty friendly. There's a red guy up there. I'm going to keep boogieing. You may want to take me out. All right, we're at the water's edge. I can tell. What I'm going to do, though, is get my uh, my little torch out. This is the quirkiest little game. All right, I'm in the water. Let's get back out. All right, let's get our fishing pole out. Ah, nah, 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 nah. Hey. It won't let me fish. There we go. It has an interesting system. You you right-click and you drag to the item. Nice cast. And then you basically randomly catch something. A lot of it depends on your skill level, how far you rank up. Uh, oh! I got a Dungeness fish. Let's cast again. Here we go. It's, it is hard to see at night. This probably, I should have probably waited till uh, daytime. But let's keep going. The day is going to come up here soon. Like I said, it doesn't take too long. What do I get? Damn. What? A whale? What? What? What do I got to do? I got to beat the whale, dudes. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> what? It just crapped on me. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all the loot! Oh my gosh! Okay, this is ridiculous. <laughs> I've been catching little crabs and whatevers. I just caught a whale. <laughs> oh man! It's got to be the haircut. Oh my goodness, that was awesome. Nothing. Oh, Dungeness fish. We are eating good. Uh, hunger wise, you know, I haven't, um, you know, you got to feed yourself. You can get like apples and different things and you can start cooking meat and stuff. It hasn't been too bad. You know, some of these games, you feel like you're starving all the time. Um, I got a frog. Okay. My pole is almost, I cannot believe I caught Moby Dick. That was crazy. And then it like spewed out all of this oil on me. What do I got? A mutant fish! <laughs> I mean, I've hit pay dirt! Oh my goodness, what is this? All right, guys, I had a little interruption there. I had uh, someone show up at my house, but... So, um, let's get back into some fishing action. We got some crabs here along the shore that I'm going to pummel. Get me some... Uh, crab meat here. I mean, I hit pay dirt with um, I think I got him. Yeah. I hit pay dirt with that whale. That was insane. Let's get the pole back out. Let's see what happens. Oh my god. I gotta get back up to my place. <laughs> I'm still blown away by Moby Dick. What do I got now? A poison frog? Do I want that? Well, let's take it. Ah, let's, let's do one more. One more cast before we head back up. Again, the it runs smooth. I've not had any glitches whatsoever. Another poison frog. A rare one. Alright, let's head, let's head back. You can see here's like someone's base here. Oh, I'm hungry. Let's eat. I got plenty of meat. 
Let's have another. Uh, I got some hay that I made. All right, we're good to go. We got some food. Let's pull out our blade here. That was a great fishing trip for the first video here um, of the Tree of Life. It's just a fun, quirky game that um, <laughs> I don't know why I'm liking it, but I am. Let's pull up our map. Let's get on course here. We're going the wrong way, guys. Definitely going the wrong way. There we go. Okay, we're heading back towards uh, Shake's Lair, my farm. I love the farmer part. It's, you know, kind of repetitive a little bit, but you kind of gather seeds and uh, you can um, make different farming. Oh, it's this way. Different different types of crops. And again, there's different environments. You can mine. There's, um, maybe I'll do a fight show you what happens when you die. When you get close to other players, you can, uh, I, I call it like proximity chat. You can then chat with them. And again, most people have been friendly. There is this going on right here. Oh, I don't know what that is actually. This, there is this. You can do, um, <laughs> you can do the different kind of expressions you know, when you run other people. And you can see, I mean, there's a lot of stuff you can build. I am just starting out, so I don't have too much. Um, it doesn't feel too much like a grind. Um, part of it's that music. I, I mean, it's like, uh, it's almost like it puts me in a trance. Here comes some more. Oh, shoot. I don't want to take that dude on. We got some big giants up here. You get in these wooded areas. You Obviously, you need wood. What's that right there? Oh, it's a rat. Um you harvest this wood. Here's some more of these. Uh, I'm going to get some more of these on the way back. Soul pieces. As long as you don't get too close to the kind of creatures, they, they won't come after you. Ah! Now let's take him on. I've leveled up my, my s knife here. That, so it's got a lot of damage to it. See that? It says dagger. You start to get... If you use things, it levels them up. And this guy's got a bunch of meat, bones, little rotten meat. But you can use you can use all that stuff for something, even rotten meat. You can check this dude's pad over here. Look at that's awesome. He's he's working on some wood over there. I'm gonna say hi to him. Give him, a, give him a thumbs up. I hope he's friendly. He looks friendly. He's naked, though. I I don't know what's up with that. He's got his buddy over there. So you can, again, you can. He's got a mask. I'm looking at him. He's smacking that wood. He's working it. Check him out. You can customize your character, how they look a little bit. Eh, he's ignoring me. Let me go back here. He's not too much of a social neighbor. It's kind of rude. Let's get up here because I want to see my inventory and uh, what I got from that whale. It was insane, like 500 pounds of oil or something. I, to be honest, I did not know that you could catch a whale in this game. That is awesome. I live like in these lava fields. I, what I did is I, I, um, I explored almost all of the island trying to find a place that had not been... Uh, I guess settled on too much yet and this is the spot I found kind of tucked away yet still close enough to trees and other resources now if you get this game and you want to hook up with those shake let me know uh, I don't have I have no buddies no friends in this I'm a loner uh, but it would be fun to have some other people and maybe uh, rally our uh, resources and create a little fortress that would be kind of cool comes that music again it's, it's feel good music I mean it's kind of elevator music but it, it just makes you feel young at heart <laughs> alright here we go hopefully my place is still up here I think it is yes he's kind of tucked back here kind of is going unnoticed and I kind of like that as I build and learn this game tree of life 
I like the name itself, to be honest. Now, what happens with trees is when they are harvested, they do grow back. Someone's been here whacking some trees. And you can see here, I uh, can harvest this wheat. But what I'm going to do, I... Yeah, I got no room in there. Let's see if I got any things I can stick in here. I don't think I do meat. A big, fresh piece of meat. My goodness. I think that's from that whale. Look at this crazy mutant fish. I got frogs. I got, oh my goodness. Meat. Rotten meat. Tin. Whale blubber. Where's the other? Oh, this looks good right here. Dungpurian fish. Mm, that's going to be good to nibble on later. Uh, I'm trying to see. Uh, this must be the oil. I must have added it to right here. Because I don't see anything else. Oh, I need to eat, guys. All right, let's bring up some hay. I'll show you how the, how the gardening here works. It's pretty cool. It's pretty fun. I'm just going to chow down on some hay here for like a horse. I want to eat an apple. Get a little fiber. All right. Just to create some space in my inventory because I'm loaded to the hilt. I do have some bones here that I could add to these bones, which I'm going to do. Ah, what's this? Look at this crab. I got some crab meat. It's awesome. All right. So to harvest this, you just pull over here. And what will happen is you'll get uh, the wheat and sometimes you'll get uh, seeds as well. And then you can replant which I'm going to do right now. I'll show you that. Here's some wheat seed right here. And then you just go up here and replant. My my plan is to build a big old garden that can sustain me. Uh, get some farm animals. Yes, you can, you can do farming. And, and just I'm going to use this area to build in. It's going to be awesome. This is a fun, quirky game, Tree of Life. Uh, if you want to see more, let me know. If you play the game, you want to hook up, and you're not crazy, uh, that would be fun as well. Again, visually kind of cartoonish, runs smooth for me. I've had no issues. Really big world here to explore. As you can see, there I am right there. Uh, in kind of these different geographical regions, snow, desert, mountains, just a fun, quirky game. All right, guys, hope you guys enjoyed that. That whale was ridiculous. Cheers, peace. Thanks for the subs. Thanks for likes. And if you can share my videos, it really does support my channel. All right, guys, I'll see you in the gaming world. Shake out.